week, nearly half of all Americans are now considered to have high blood pressure. The American Heart Association says high blood pressure should now be treated at 130 over 80 instead of 140 over 90. Doctors say most of the new diagnoses will be addressed through lifestyle changes and just a small increase in prescribed medication. Bottom line, nobody likes taking medicines, but nobody wants to have a stroke. Nobody wants to have a heart attack. And so if we can reduce blood pressures from our previous 140 down to 130, we know we'll be saving lives. We know there'll be less heart attacks. We know there'll be less strokes. High blood pressure is second only to smoking for causing preventable heart disease and stroke deaths. For the first